Sean, did you hear about that kid that got kidnapped by the internet predator? Oh no, I didn't. Tell me about it. Well, he was online, like in chat rooms, and he had, he had a website and stuff. And then I think he shared information with this guy, and you know he got kidnapped, and he's not here anymore. Oh, that stinks. Yeah. I mean, what do you think should, you should do, like, to be safe in the chat room, for example? It's really interesting, but I think, really, my opinion, I, I just think you shouldn't talk to anyone you don't know, because they may not be who you think they are. Yeah. yeah, and you shouldn't really share personal information either, because, you know, with any bit of, any bit of information that they can find, and, you know, they can, you can be found by people that aren't, you know, safe. I think he had a website too. You know what? What precautions should you, should you take there? I mean, I would think again, don't share your personal information so that no one can find you. What about you? What do you think? Well, I think you shouldn't post information that is linked to you, really. And along with that, I think that I mean, you shouldn't post like pictures of yourself or like any clues to where you are or anything that I can identify where you are or who you are. Yeah. And I think he used email a lot too. I mean, I use email too, but I don't put my real name in the email address or the act or on the actual server because then people know what your name is and just from your name they can find you. Yeah, well, I think you shouldn't even email anyone anything that could lead a hacker to your location. Like, if a predator were to be a hacker, they could just hack into an email that you sent your mom and they could find out where you live or something. And also, just don't email anyone you don't trust or you haven't met or anything like that. And for other people out there, you know, kids that go on the web, they might get on a site that has you know, risky images. And um, so, I mean, I guess in that situation, what you should do, you should get off the site immediately and you should tell a trusted adult, adult right away, you know? And you know, another thing with like risky photos, Sometimes it's not always a photo. Sometimes it's just like a pop-up window. It shows like, you know, you just want a free iPad or, you know, download these cool wallpapers, you know? And if you click on them, they might be viruses. And they probably, I mean, obviously, you didn't want a free iPad. And who knows what viruses can do to your computer. And they could even hack into your computer and find information and stuff. And, you know, like, also, about, like, chat rooms and stuff, I mean, if someone asks for your photo, just don't give it to them. I mean, it's just not right to give someone you don't know, you've never seen before, you don't even probably know their real name, don't even give them their, your photo, ever. Yeah, I agree, because that photo could lead to valuable information that could help hackers find, you know, where you are, which could lead to kidnapping, you know, and you should cut off all contact with that person immediately so they don't get any more information about you. Also, if you're, you know, in an inappropriate conversation with someone, you know, what should you do then? Well, what you should do in that situation, you should close the browser and go tell an adult. I mean, it may be uncomfortable and an awkward moment for a kid or of any age or even an adult to tell a parent or a trusted adult about an inappropriate conversation you had. But, I mean, it's the right thing to do. It'll, it might save you your life in some of the worst cases. And the same thing with inappropriate images. If you ever encounter that on the web, you should get off the site immediately and tell, tell an adult so that, you know, you're safe online. Yeah, I mean, you should just never visit that website again. And, you know, I mean, the worst of all is if someone in an online chat room or something asks to meet you face to face, just quit the browser and, I mean, just get off the site right away and never talk to that person again. Yeah, you should definitely tell an adult immediately in that case because you know, that's, that's the worst case. If someone meets you, it could be someone that they're not and you know, it could lead to a kidnapping. Well, I think I should get back to class. You know? I think we're kind of late, so. Yeah, I, I agree. I mean, but I, I gotta get back to class too, so. I mean, I just hope that kid's alright that got kidnapped by that guy. But I mean, at least he'll learn a lesson from what he did. Yeah.